Hello everyone, today we're going to be looking at passing through objects in Unity. Let's check it out. Here I have a scene I've made in Unity. I have two ramps with two identical balls that are in the exact same position. And then I have these two boxes over here. Let's see what happens when I run the game. Both of the balls start falling down the ramps, and then by the time they reach the end, one of them stops and the other one goes right through the box. Now these boxes are almost identical except for one thing. The box in front here is set to be a trigger. This makes it so that anything will pass through that game object. This is pretty cool and it has a lot of uses in your games. To make an object that other game objects can pass through, all you have to do is create a game object in the scene. In this case, I'm gonna make a cube. I'm gonna go ahead and give this cube a different material so it sticks out. And then I'm gonna check the box on the box collider that says is trigger. This controls whether you can go through the box or not. So now both of these balls should go right through the trigger volume and then hit the end. Now triggers can be used for all sorts of things. You can have them be invisible in your scene by unchecking the mesh render box here. Now that we have a trigger volume here, we can use it to cause something to happen when a game object passes through it. By using a trigger, we can add secret areas to our game. We can also use it to add graphical details to our game, like a water level in this swamp. Let's see what you can build in Unity. Yeah. 